Hi. Sorry, right now I'm in a kitchen in the Shiso. That's why I have a glow and I have a mask. But can you hear? It's okay? Okay, so today I'd like to show you maybe recently, you know, many ramen restaurants also have started the delivery. For example, vegan ramen shop and the Yatta and, uh, and also Arigato, even Uki 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 Green also they started. She's also, they're gonna, we're gonna start it like uh, next, maybe soon. So then, maybe you have a chance to make the ramen by yourself. For example here, this one is, uh, I got the ramen delivery from the Arigato. I order Gyukotsu ramen, yeah. Here is a broth, and here is the fresh noodles. And then, topping, yeah. And also, I got from the ukiuki as well. Here is the broth, original ukiuki, original broth, yeah. And then here is the set of the noodles and toppings. And the ukiuki, they attach the yeah the how to make the the method of the how to prepare the ramen as well. Maybe if you check this one, I think it's okay. Yeah, you can make it nicely. Yeah. But today, I'd like to show you, yeah, how to prepare the ramen as a professional. And this kind of, you know, before we couldn't get the fresh noodle from the restaurants. Right now, maybe I can compare some the noodles. Here is a noodle from Ukiuki. And here is a noodle from the Arigato. Yeah. I think the size is 26, number 26 knife, and this one is 22. Yeah. Now I have a noodles. This one is shiso noodles, yeah. It's different, yeah. So you got the noodles, so you can prepare whatever you want, yeah. And topping also, you can make it on your special toppings on your ramen. So, maybe first, in a quick, I'm gonna show you what, how to prepare. First, please prepare the big pot for boiling the noodles. Today, I have a, like a nice boiling, <laughs> boiling noodle machine, so I'm gonna use this one. And second, please prepare the small pot for warming up the broth. Maybe let's start from the arigato one. Here is the broth. Okay. And we're gonna start it to warm it up. In the meantime, yeah, prepare the, your bowl. Maybe this one, or you can you can use the fresh, like a front version. Also, it's okay. The important first is, first, please warm it up your bowls. When you serve the ramen, it's called the bowls, the broth, like a soup, will be immediately cooled it down. So first, put the water, and then warm it up the bowls. So, you start it to boiling, then, okay, so time to boil the noodles. First, please not to touch it. Around 10 seconds later, start it to mix slowly, slowly. And then bowl is already warm enough. And then please wipe the inside. No? Okay. Today 
is a gear code from Arigato. So I think maybe if you want to make the bubbly, please serve it from the top. Like that. Okay. It's okay. Like this. Ooh, nice. Then first pick up the broths. Ah, pick up the noodles. Yeah. And then mix well. And then make it flat. Yeah, make it flat like this. Maybe I just want to try. Very nice punch. Oh, they added the also flavored oil separately. Okay, so then put the toppings. And if you have some additional vegetables and your toppings, you, you can try to put it on this one. Today I have a... Mm, okay. Yeah, maybe I need more beef. Okay, so here we go. <clears throat> here is the arigato, arigato gyukotsu ramen, the home version. Yeah. You can arrange whatever you want, but uh, I recommend not to put too much toppings. Yeah, because taste is gonna be messy. So here. Okay. You wanna try? Okay, here we go. Maybe I'm gonna make the second one. Uki uki one. Yeah, uki uki. You can follow by this description. Yeah. The broth first. If you order from the several kinds of, like a, you know, different restaurants, for example, like me, Arigato one and Ukiuki one, you can mix it and switch it also, it's nice. For example, this one is Arigato flavored oil. Maybe if I use the Ukiuki, it can be nice. Okay. So this one is noodles. This 
kind of like a creamy broth. If you, if you, can, if you can see, it looks like boiling. But actually, temperature is a little bit lower. Normally, when the water is boiling, it, it, this temperature is the 100 degree, right? But in case of the Python, if you boil it, it's actually a little bit low, 90, 80. So if you want to get hot one, after starting the boiling, it please wait a little bit more. But the max, yeah, it won't be get higher. Okay, so maybe I'm gonna start. Maybe first warm up the walls. Dishes, like a pasta, kind of like a group category of the pasta. So the texture of the noodle is the best, like the most important part. So you know, important thing is before eating, boiling. That is the you can get a nice texture of the noodles. And uh, this kind of style, advantage, the good point is you know you can eat anytime. You got delivery and you can eat at the night. If you have some idea of the new toppings. You can prepare. You can arrange whatever you want, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna put toppings, but uh, hmm, maybe it's my tissue. I'm gonna load it. They have a, like a chili paste, but I also made it by myself. So maybe my style of the habanero chili paste. Yeah. Arigato flavor oil. Okay. So, yeah. Here is the Ukiuki ramen home version. <laughs> I'm curious about this combination. Arigato flavor oil and then uki uki broth. Oh my god, it's 
flavor of this one is garlic flavor. For example, <coughs> for example, like you can make the, like uh, your own oil. Also, it's okay. Like green onion oil, garlic oil. And for example, chicken pepper. And uh, yeah, chicken oil. You can arrange at home. And also in your cookie, I hear the you know arigato. Also, they are selling the pro, like a uh, fresh noodles, right? So maybe. You can order only fresh noodle as well. Then you can make all your broth and then make the oil and make the your own tare and then maybe you can enjoy. I think yeah, we cannot go out so much, but uh, we can. I hope maybe you enjoy the cooking the ramen and get some new idea. Yeah, I hope maybe uh, yeah maybe it's gonna be okay. <laughs> okay. So maybe uh, I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna finish eat this one. So bye bye. <laughs>